Hi and welcome. Today we are going to make Indian kebab with pita bread and two different kinds of salad. I hope you like the recipe, so please consider subscribing. You start by making the bread and the exact amount of ingredients you will find at my blog, of course. You start by dissolving the yeast in uh, water, and I'm using fresh yeast, so it's 98 degrees Fahrenheit degree water that I dissolve it in. And then you just add the flour and process it for five minutes, increasing the speed after two minutes about. And then you add um, a tablespoon of um, olive oil and uh, process it again. Then you can add the salt and uh, process it for another two or three minutes. Weigh it and divide it either into four or eight different parts. I think four parts for the American style would be just fine. And uh, roll each, um, each part in a, into an even bowl and let it cover and let ferment for 30 minutes. And after that time, you take it up and uh, have some flour on the baking table or area. And then you um, roll each one into 12, 5 inches about uh, in diameter or bigger if you wish. Um, and then you place them on the parchment paper again and let it ferment for an additional 30 minutes. That's what they look like after 30 minutes. Then you bake it in a hot oven, 437 Fahrenheit, 225 centigrade for seven to 10 minutes. And that this is what they look like when they come out. So they are not very big, the ones that I divided. Then you start with the meat. And of course, every uh, all the exact measurements you will find at my blog. You put the meat, minced meat, the yogurt, the spices, sambal olek and egg yolk, and mix it very, very well until you have a very smooth um, batter. Um, you cover it and let it uh, refrigerate it for 15 minutes, and then you roll it and put it on skewers, or you flatten it and, and bake it in the oven or in uh, on the grill. So. For, uh, 437 Fahrenheit, 15 to 20 minutes if you are using the oven. It's so delicious. You can't just imagine. Wonderful summer meal. As we say in Iran, Nushijan or enjoy.